Hello and welcome, everybody. I am your break host and senior and resident wax cracker. I am Christopher. Welcome to Crack and Wax. This is our very final, our last break of 2017. Uh, and that's pretty much only because we basically just break on Saturdays. <laughs> Today's Saturday. And uh, I'm, I'm going back to work tomorrow like like the schmuck that I am. Uh, I've been on vacation for the last week, and man, I could use some more days off. But working tomorrow morning, because we got a big old football game in town, and someone's got to be downtown for that mess. So uh, so uh going to take a, a quick look in the chat room here. Hello, Hero Habit, uh, Z Grizz, that's Alex, and Kelly. Kelly, what's up? Good to see you. Um, so as I mentioned, uh, this is our final break of the year we're doing 2017 bowman's best we got two boxes here uh we did our did our pre-break show about a half hour ago and uh here are the team assignments if you miss that um kind of put my hand over here so we can read the teams uh so if you miss that here they are i'm not going to read them off right now you can just kind of kind of see where we're at on that um before we get going i do want to mention uh we do still have just a very few teams left, and that was poor grammar, but still, we just have very few teams left <laughs> in our uh, 2018 Tops Bundle. And if you're not familiar with what that is, uh, basically, it's three case breaks, uh, three case breaks uh, starting off 2018. It'll be Top Series 1, Heritage, and Inception for one down payment, and uh, you'll get the same team for those three breaks. And uh, you just watch the cards roll in. So that's that's all there is to it. Uh, if you want to go to crackamax.com slash shop, pick up your team. Offer ends after tomorrow. So don't wait. Let's get uh, let's get cracking on these boxes here. Bowman's best. There's not really a whole lot to talk about that I didn't mention already uh, in the pre-break show. Um, other than we're going to get four chrome autographs out of each master box. Shorter checklist, a few different inserts to work with, a bunch of different parallels. You're going to have veterans and rookies as well as prospects. So too many boxes per master. Hey, All About Cards, how's it going? I just saw All About Cards hop into the chat room there. Thank you very much, appreciate it. I do want to give a shout out to Buckeye City Breaks. Um, they recently won fa uh, favorite breaker of the year on Go GTS Live's awards show. So congratulations to those guys. Well deserved. They've only been breaking for like half a year, and they've made waves. So well deserved. Congratulations. To you guys there. We've uh, collaborated with them. I think it was on the Allen and Ginter break earlier this year that uh, they helped us out with. As did Hero Habit, who happens to be in the chat room as well. All right, pack number one. Our very first Bowman's Best card of the year is Vlad Guerrero Jr. Sean Newcomb rookie card. And then this is one of the inserts. This is the Baseball America Dean's List, uh, where they give a letter grade uh, to certain... Uh, prospects. Uh, Clint gets an A. <laughs> and this is a, an, uh, I believe this is the 1997 throwback design. This is Dominic Smith, another, uh, this is a uh, best class. And Jose De Leon, rookie card. Here's what the backs look like for Bowman's best this year. This is a refractor as denoted on the back side. And you can kind of see it shimmering in the, uh, the lamp light there. Well, I hope everyone had a good Christmas or uh, or Hanukkah or any other holiday that you may have celebrated uh, this month and in the last week. Certainly uh, hope you'll have a great New Year's Eve tomorrow and New Year's Day on Monday. Shane Baz, Glaber Torres, Anthony Rizzo, Mirror Image. So we'll have to uh, figure out who gets this one since it's uh, two teams. Uh, Brennan McKay and Anthony Rizzo. And Keston Hira for the Brewers. Now, for those uh, wondering how we decide uh, multiple teams, we do have those rules. 
on the website, crackamax.com. It's uh, under every single product that we sell. It's the, under our Crack and Wax break rules. So if you're wondering about how we determine how we... Uh, like a... <laughs> Like I was saying, sorry, distracting myself there. How we determine who ends up with uh, multi-team cards. Just head there and check out the rules. Uh, Chris Bryant, Daniel Murphy, Paul Goldschmidt, and our first, oh, and it's a big one. First autograph is of Royce Lewis. This is the number one overall draft pick. Nice on-card auto, and it's numbered 37 of 99, you see the Twins goes to Diane. Holy crap. You cannot do much better than this. That's what you say to me. And I'm going to swear right now, holy shit, literal quirk is here. Hello. Just as I pull our first autograph, it's... Did you hear who I, picked, who I uh, just pulled? No. It's the number one overall draft pick, Minnesota Twins, Royce Lewis. Holy cow. Yeah. Great. Diane has the twins. Diane. Diane newish? Newish. And not in the chat room as far as I know. Oh, okay. So this will be a nice surprise for her. Congratulations, Diane. And uh, Raymond Tapia right behind Royce. Excellent. It usually takes me a few years to pull the autograph of the uh, <laughs> number one draft pick. Nice that I got him out of Bowman's best. Robinson Cano. John Carlos Stanton, Adam Hazley, and a Corey Seeger, Dean's List. He gets an A plus apparently. And Joey Votto. Well, we've got uh, Hero Habit, of course. Uh, we've got Alex Zegris. All about cards. Kelly's here. Hey guys. There may be others who are. Not chatting, so hello to everyone who is either watching live or on the replay and not in the chat room. Uh, Raphael Devers, Kenley Jansen, Best Cuts, I think I called it Best Class, uh, Corey Seeger, Freddie Freeman, this is numbered 101 of 150, and Ichiro. which means we should expect an autograph out of this pack here. I'm going to say it's going to go to the... You can't hear her, but LQ is calling, calling the hit. I'm she, calling the hit. I'm going to say Rangers. She's saying Rangers. Now, keep in mind, LQ has not taken a look at the checklist ahead of, <laughs> ahead of time. Uh, Clayton Kershaw, Will Myers in a Padres uniform... Because who else would he be in? I was, ex I, I just accidentally uh, confused him with Evan Longoria for some reason. <laughs> For, former Ray, actually. So there you go. Jonas Cespedes. And Evan White is your autograph. And he is decidedly not a ranger on this card. He is with the Mariners. And the Mariners goes to Alex T. Alex? Alex in the chat room tonight. I don't need to say it. He, Killing you. No, nah, I don't need to say it. Hi. <laughs> Hero habit says Brewers. <laughs> <laughs> so congratulations, Alex, on the non-Ragers uh, Mariners Evan White autograph. And then Brendan McKay is right behind there. All right. Starting off pretty strong. Oh, we have a cat in here. Let's hope he just stays down there. Uh, Hero Habit says, LQ and I both were wrong. Well. That is such a rarity. Yeah. But you're big to admit it, so. Mm -hmm. Let's get that. Oh, Should we get all the packs out of there? And I have a cat on the top of my chair. Hello, cat. Stay back there. I don't want cat hair on these cards. You don't never get cats. You don't let them in here unless it's with me. Uh-huh. Which was never ago. All right. Chris Davis, Mackenzie Gore, Jose Ramirez, and right away we've got an autograph. It's Heliot Ramos for the Giants. That goes to Vilma. Hello, Vilma. Woohoo. 
non-numbered. Does Tony have a spot in the break? You mean Hero Habit? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Hero Habit does not have a spot in the break. Hero Habit also says it'll never happen again as far as you both being oh, wrong okay. about the same yeah. thing at the same time. So congratulations, Vilma, on your autograph of Heliot Ramos for the Giants. Behind that, we've got Corey Seager. Who, Hero Habit? I say Hero Habit a lot of uh, a lot of the time. Corey Seager. Corey Seager. Uh, Bryce Harper. Mookie Betts. John Duplantier. Dean's List, A-. I feel like you're saying that wrong. Is that correct? Yeah, probably not. And here we've got a nice atomic refractor of Reese Hoskins on the best cuts. So this is probably our box atomic refractor. Uh, Phillies, of course, goes to debut. Of course. Of course. And this is non-numbered as far as I can tell. I didn't see a number on the front. Looks like shattered glass. That's kind of cool. I like that. Congrats, Debbie. And Blake Rutherford right behind there. Chris Sale, Nick Senzel, best cuts of Mike Piazza, mirror images of Royce Lewis and Carlos Correa. So again, we'll have to determine who actually will end up owning this card. I'll have to refer to my rules. Uh, Luke Weaver, rookie card. All About Cards says Atomics are not numbered. All right, Josh Donaldson, Miguel Cabrera, Kyle Tucker, and our final autograph of the box is Drew Ellis for the Diamondbacks. Formerly a Ranger? No, and that also goes to Alex T. Congrats once again, Alex T. And then Clark Schmidt. LQ LQ is egging me on over here. <laughs> she wants me to uh, rely on my shtick tonight. Nah, just me. Everyone knows what I'm going to say anyway. Just just say it in your head. <laughs> Yuan Moncada rookie card. Bradley Zimmer rookie card. A Dean's List of Scott Kingery. He gets an A. See, I was really curious about this set. Does anyone get anything under an A on this? <laughs> I mean, because Tops is all about, you know, because of their license, they can only make the players be shown in a, in a positive light. So would they dare put a anything below an A- minus on these cards? Anyway, uh, Jorge Alfaro for the Phillies. This looks like a purple refractor numbered 81 of 250. Hero Habit says, Alex bringing the mojo tonight. Hey, he said it, not me. Uh, Austin Beck. Checks in the mail, Tony. Yeah. <laughs> Who's this Tony you keep talking about? Founder. Director. <laughs> El Presidente. El Presidente. Um, Hero Habit. Christian Arroyo, rookie card. Andrew Benintendi, rookie. Charlie Blackman. And, well, another Atomic Refractor, this time of Will Myers. Oh. And Willie Ademis for the Rays. I think I just got why he calls it Hero Habit. Okay, this ought to be good. So, you didn't hear that, I don't think. LQ just said, oh, I think I understand why he calls it Hero Habit now. Please explain. <laughs> Is it a play on heroin habit? And if so, LQ thinks she just had an epiphany. Did I crack the code? Do you know something about the founder of Hero Habit that I don't? Uh, the founder of Hero Habit, according to LQ, is the biggest square in the world. 
He also says, no, it's not. Oh, well, it is now. <laughs> you may need to change your branding, I think, after this. <laughs> All right, so we're going to dive into our final master box, I guess, since we've got too many boxes out. Tell him my phone's dead, so if he's trying to DM me, he's mad, I, I won't get it. Yeah, started. very predictably, LQ's phone is dead. <laughs> so as I mentioned, don't forget, we do have a few teams left in our tops bundle. Our Tops Bundle will no longer be available after tomorrow. And you can still enter for a shot at a free spot in our December free box break, which will be the next break that we'll do. Probably the first break of next year. By the way, parallels are easy, easy to spot in a stack. They are slightly thicker and white-edged. I've noticed that, yeah. Uh, Hero Pet Habit says, great, thanks, LQ. Who doesn't want brand association with heroin addiction? An, an alt grunge band from the 90s? I don't know. Jay Groom, Tristan McKenzie, Eloy Jimenez, Dean's List. He gets an A+. Plus. A, another Will Myers uh, parallel. This one is 69 of 99. This looks to be the green refractor. And Dansby Swanson, rookie card. You should pull up a chair. Steroid studs? Is that how he's going to rebrand? Yes. I I didn't say it. She did. I was checking out your new uh, Noah Syndergaard, Evan White, Ken Griffey Jr. Best cuts, Mirror Image, Brendan McKay, and Clayton Kershaw. Okay, I'm gonna go to the store. Bye. You're going? But we're almost done. Are you? Yeah. Okay. Austin Meadows. Plus, I might need to tell you what I would, would like to request. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I don't know if I could do that while I'm doing all this, but okay. Uh, Jake Lamb. Victor Robles. Joe Adele. And we've got an autograph. This is Lucas Ursig for the Milwaukee Brewers. Oh, Diane. Was right. <laughs> yeah, Tony, who's that? Uh, Hero Habit ended up actually kind of predicting an autograph for the Brewers. Uh, and Diane gets this one, uh, Brewers. Uh, she also got the Royce Lewis earlier. Congratulations there. Very nice. And Max Scherzer is right behind Ursig. Kevin Smith. Uh, I'm not going to mention him. Uh, Ronald Okuna, A+. Plus. Raking Rookies, Uleski Greel, rookie card. It's an insert we haven't pulled yet. And Ahmed Rosario. Oh, okay. Right, bye, LQ couldn't make it through a whole break again. Yeah. See you later. I'm going to <laughs> Oh, she's getting me dinner. Okay, you get a free pass. Jeez. Bye now. Uh, Alex Fajardo, Francisco Lindor, Michael Kopik, Atomic Refractor of Raphael Devers, and Alex Bregman rookie card. Hero Habit says, the dude has a nice looking auto too. Yeah, it's actually not too bad. Um, I get the Lucas part, maybe not the Urseg part. <laughs> That's just me. Final pack of the, well, second to last mini box. Uleski Greel, Tyler Glasnow, Jose Altuve, Lourdes Greel Jr., Toronto Blue Jays. Blue Jays goes to Alex. Congratulations again, Alex, and hey, it's your team, as far as I know. <laughs> and then Kevin Matan, right behind there. 
I, I will have to say, with as busy as these, I mean, these are some busy freaking cards. They are pretty sharp looking, though. Final box. This is it. No more after this for, for 2017. Make sure the box is empty. See, nothing in there. Okie doke. Here we go. I'm going to guess there's an auto in here. I'm just uh, kind of feeling that. Uh, George Springer, Jose Barrios, Christian Stewart gets an A-. minus, And I was wrong. Uh, but we do have an Andrew Benintendi best cuts throwback, as well as a Jake Berger. Here's something interesting. I'm just noticing on the back of this card here. I didn't notice it yet on other cards. Uh, there seems to be a little bit of... Or is that part of the design? Oh, that might be part of the design. Never mind. I thought that was some kind of ink splotch there. But no, that's part of the design. Never mind. <laughs> Blake Rutherford. Luke Weaver rookie card. Clark Schmidt. Mirror image of Chris Sale and Mackenzie Gore and Buster Posey. Well, I'm going to have a fun old time trying to divvy up those mirror image cards. All right. Austin Beck. Willie Ademis. Corey Seeger. Nate Pearson with another Blue Jays autograph for Alex T. Very nice. Two Jays autos in a row. And then Craig Kimbrell behind that. Very careful there. Jose De Leon, rookie card. Keston Hura. Brent Honeywell gets an A. Willie Ademis, purple. 234 of 250. And Jorge Alfaro, rookie. Two final packs. Rimal Tapia, Ho, uh, Joey Votto, Ichiro, Best Cuts, Dylan Cousins, Ronald Okuna, which, if I'm not mistaken, means the final pack will have our final hit. Any guesses? Who's this going to be? I've already pulled the uh, Royce Lewis, so... Out of the first, uh, that was the first autograph. I can't believe that. Uh, Brennan McKay, Dansby Swanson, Austin Meadows. All right, this is probably going to be it. So I'm going to pull this card first. Freddie Freeman, and then behind Austin Meadows. Who's it going to be, everybody? Who's it going to be? It's Lazarito Armenteros for the Oakland A's, all because Hero Habit is in the chat room. Uh, but Alex T, you got this one too. Alex T getting a nice handful of autos out of this break. Congratulations, buddy. You got our final hit of the year. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's do a little quick hit recap. Lazarito was the last one we just pulled. Nate Pearson and Lourdes Greel Jr. All three of those going to Alex T. Lucas Urseg is for Diane. 
Drew Ellis, that is also Alex. Heliot Ramos for the Giants, that is Vilma. What I, I don't I don't believe Vilma is in the chat room. Uh, Evan White for the Mariners, that is also Alex. And then Royce Lewis. That's got to be the big one. Number 37 of 99 for Diane. Spectacular. I certainly did not expect to pull a Royce Lewis auto. And uh, I, you know what? We've had tremendous luck this year. We've had some amazing breaks this year. And I just want to thank you guys for all of the support this year, for for filling up all of our breaks this year. We, I, I think there might have only been like one spot the entire year that I had to pay for. <laughs> And that's just that's just amazing. Uh, we've really ramped things up this year, and we couldn't have done it without your support. And we did something this year that was a major goal of ours here at Crack and Wax, and that was to surpass the ten thousand dollars donated uh, threshold. Um, you know, and I and I'd love to be able to uh, hit the fifteen, if not twenty thousand dollar mark in the coming year. No. I don't know if we're going to continue ramping things up. I certainly made changes to the website to be able to handle that. So I, I hope things uh, continue in a in a forward trend. And if it does, it's all because of you guys. So I, I can't thank uh, all of those who have been watching these, these videos and participating in these breaks, who have been supporting us, like Hero Habit has been one of our biggest supporters. Um, Breaker Culture has been... Uh, a great supporter. Uh, Buckeye City Breaks uh, have had our backs. Um, so many other people. Uh, I, I couldn't list them all right now and keep this at a short <laughs> video. So, um, so yeah, thank you so much for a, a hugely successful 2017. And as Hero Habit just said in the chat room, let's take it to 25,000 in 2018. And that, that would be amazing if we could do get it to 25,000 but let's focus on 15,000 first and I, I really think that we've got a good shot at that and uh as I mentioned if you want to help me with that we've got three case breaks all rolled into our 2018 bundle and they're all charity case breaks so they'll all be uh portions of the proceeds will be going to some amazing causes and that'll help um just a few teams left crackamax.com slash shop pick up your team offer ends after tomorrow also, make sure to sign yourself up for a shot at a spot in our December free box break. That'll be the very next break that we do. That'll be next year. Uh, probably the first break we do next year. So, all right, everybody. For those watching the replay, what did you think of these boxes of Bowman's Best? Let us know in the poll that's right up here at the top somewhere of this video. <laughs> It'll show up in the in the replay. Uh, vote in the poll at the top of the video. And uh, as always... Keep cracking that wax. Have a good night and happy new year, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.